This is the final, final step in solving the 4x4. I'm going to call it step 3C, and it's corner parity. If you were solving the cube and you got to the very end, and this happened where these two are in the wrong place, they're switched, you have to do the following formula, and it'll make you start over the whole top side minus the cross. And but that will cause this to be it going in the right way, so the whole cube is solvable because right now it's not. So the formula is little r, which is the inner right, the inner layer right, two. So it's inner r two, u two, inner r two, w two, inner r two. W2. And that does this. So then you just have to resolve the cube from there. As so. And then do the corners. And then you just need to orient them. And then so there two more times because they're facing towards and away from you. And this cube is solved. I would have done it faster, but this chain shell can't really, doesn't have that good alignment. But, you should have been able to solve this 4x4 with these five videos. And I have done tutorials on the 2x2, the 3x3, and the Rubik's Cube Junior. Next up, I'm going to do a video on a tutorial on the 5x5.